What's up guys, welcome back to another vlog. Uh, Mackie Dave here with my boy Nico. We're rolling out to Louisville right now. Go meet up with some teammates, Jacob, Wesley. Y'all saw them in the last vlog. If you didn't, go watch it. I don't know what you're doing if you didn't watch it. Lots of fun on tap today. Four hours with the boys. Uh, looks like it might rain. Pretty adventurous, whatever. All right, boys and girls, back home. Uh, just got out the shower, freshly cleaned, picking my hair out now. Uh, we're gonna go see a sponsor, um, me and Nico. Probably get some Chick-fil-A on the way. Go pick up some sponsored things, confidential stuff, you know, pro things. Not messing with y'all. We're not pro, like cat threes. Anyways, yeah, so we're gonna go do that. I'm about to go eat first a little bit because I don't know if I want Chick-fil-A. Um, I only crave Chick-fil-A on Sundays, so it's like a thing. I don't know. I don't know if that's just me. Maybe it's just me. I don't think it is. Anyways, stay tuned. Bye, bro. So I've been helping my brother uh, cook because uh, some of our friends are coming over tonight and we cook some dinner. Uh, we all gonna hang out, but we finally about to get on the bike. Uh, it's probably only gonna be an hour and a half. Uh, still gonna hit my openers. Still gotta get race ready, all that good stuff. Um, but it'll be a little bit shorter because of the sunset. Uh, it doesn't look like it's gonna rain anymore. morning guys um i'm up it's about 7 30 i'm about to hit out a little coffee ride with my boy nico um and then we're gonna go race <laughs> my boy Nico now just picked him up we're on the way to the race uh, we got about an hour and ten minutes to get there uh, should be should be a good solid race it looks like it might rain a little bit we got like a hundred people in this race and it's only like it's like a small crit course like it's not anything like big big enough for a hundred people if I'm being honest so we'll see how that goes um, all right, y'all, the race is complete. Um, 
shoot, don't mind my hair. Uh, solid race, fun race. Fast All race. of us boys were up there. Jacob didn't have the best day. Uh, I think he was feeling a little under the weather. Probably uh, the, I don't know, spring pollen. That was messing with me before the race too, so I understand. Um, but yeah, pretty fast race. We were all up there. Plan was just launching. We were just launching moves, trying to get get uh, good opportunities for Will, because Will's our older guy. He's not U23 anymore, so we're really trying to help him um, get that contract that he deserves. For sure, he's been putting in the work. But uh, yeah, we were just launching moves, trying to give him an opportunity to counterattack and get off and stay off, or just launching moves so he could bridge up to us. All that good stuff. Nothing stuck. It was just so fast. Um, we ended up just fast for the course. It wasn't like 30 miles an hour, but it was like up down. So it was fairly, it was relatively fast. Um, but yeah, solid race. Uh, I think he finished, what, what did they say, 12th? I thought it was top 10, um, but that's still solid. I, he, we weren't planning on a sprint, so none of us were there to help him. We just kept launching, even, excuse me, even down to like the last lap. Uh, and then Nico had an issue with uh, someone crashing in front of him being stupid but we're not going to talk about that because we don't like to talk bad about other riders um, okay so it was 29 miles 28 miles an hour uh about 16 or 1700 feet of climb so pretty lumpy um and then my power was like 260 average so nothing crazy and 309 normalized that's the pace that was how hard it was or how easy it was depending on how much stronger and slower you are than me yeah. Yeah, but the All right, y'all. Back in Winston Salem, um, got a box. Uh, the box from earlier in the video when I went to go get the GoPros. We're about to open this bad boy up and uh, start setting one of these up so I can use it tomorrow. Trey, my teammate, uh, to the 4 5 race that starts at 9, even though my race starts at 1 30. But he's asleep, I think, or something. He didn't respond, he didn't come outside. I was there for a couple minutes, so I'm going back home. I might go back to sleep because I'm tired. I didn't get to sleep that early last night, like maybe 11 30. All right, y'all, update. Uh, I was riding with Nico. And he broke his rear derail cable, shifting cable, whatever it's called. Um, so he rode to my coach's house and he's getting that fixed before we leave. So I'm meeting him at my coach's house, John. Um, and then I'm going with them. So I'm not driving. Just trying to show y'all what, what it's really like being on an amateur U23 team before bike races and at bike races and after bike races, etc. So you get to see behind the scenes and all that good stuff.
Stay in the GoPro, bro. Alright, y'all. A little post race analysis while I change. Uh, solid race. It wasn't as fast as yesterday, but it was uh, much harder. Um, it was windy. Yeah, just windy, hard race. Um, all the boys stayed in except for Jacob. He had an issue with something. I don't remember. But he had some issue that ended up making it where he couldn't finish. Uh, but he'll come back for sure. Um, Will Harden, the guy we were working for, we got, well, he got himself in the break. Um, he got in the break and finished seventh, I think. Uh, me, Nico, and Wes just finished in the group. I'm not gonna chase our teammate and not gonna sprint for like 20th. But yeah, solid race, solid weekend. Um, got the team working together. Got us all out here at the same race. Um, I'm excited to see what we can do this year. All right, y'all, well, that's gonna be the end of the video. Appreciate you for tuning in and uh, tune in for our next race that's on Tuesday. Might have some, some better GoPro footage from that.